Hey, what's up there guys? Corey here with Gotta Be Mobile and the new Samsung Galaxy S9. And what we want to do is really quickly here today show you how to take a screenshot on your new phone. Now, there's a couple of different ways to take screenshots on Samsung devices, but if you're coming from like an older phone like the Galaxy S6, it's changed because there's no longer a physical home button. But that doesn't matter because Samsung actually has three different ways to capture whatever is on your screen. Now this is nice for you know, saving an email, taking pictures of a recipe online, or just to save funny photos and send them to your friends and what have you. So take a screenshot or a screen capture or a screen grab, whatever you want to call it, you push and hold the power button and volume down at the same time and let go. And that will instantly capture anything on the screen. So I'm going to change hands here and instantly push and hold. And there you go. I have taken a screenshot on the Galaxy S9. Very simple. And now that is in the notification bar down here. Pull that down. You can share and edit or delete that screenshot. Very quick, very simple, very easy to do. The other way here is called palm swipe to capture. Now you've probably done this by accident and uh, you can disable it if you'd like, but you basically just take your hand and kind of like swipe it across the screen, but you have to be touching the screen. So you go like that and it instantly takes a screenshot. It's also kind of nice, kind of convenient if you don't want to fumble between hands like I had to do to, 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 you know, try to do the button combination. And then finally, there is one other way which I kind of have disabled, but it's with Bixby. Just like, you know, the Google Assistant, Samsung has Bixby. If you have her enabled, or him, you can go ahead and say, okay, Bixby, take a screenshot, and it will instantly fire up and take a screenshot of whatever is being shown on your screen. Or you can hit the dedicated Bixby button on the side of your phone, ask her to take a screenshot, blah, 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 and you will be good there. But there's one other thing we wanted to show, and that's called the scrolling screenshot. This is one of my favorite features of Samsung's screenshot feature. And basically, whenever you take a screen grab, more information pops up at the bottom of the screen. Now, from here, you can do like edits and change a couple of things, but it's the capture more button that is kind of neat. So, take a screenshot, then hit capture more, or scroll capture. Take another one, take another one, and I'm now taking screenshots of the entire page rather than just what's on the screen. Now this is great for recipes or text message conversations, you name it. You can instantly take screenshots of something much larger than just what's on the screen. So that's it guys. Quick look at how to take screenshots on your Galaxy S9 and then of course if they are always up there at the notification bar for you to do as you please. But that's it guys. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to Gotta Be Mobile for more coverage of Samsung's new phone.